Molecular engineering is really a new discipline. It did not exist 10 years ago. Industries are really having challenges in trying to recruit people with the right training to be able to work at the forefront of these fields. The Master of Science in the Pritzker School of Molecular Engineering is really for students that want advanced coursework, uh, advanced training, with a goal to apply those skills in industry. In molecular engineering, we are really forward-looking. We focus both on the fundamental research and on the technology. So if they take those courses, they will be well prepared for a lot of the job available in the market. I was working as an IT consultant with IBM, uh, and I'd been there for about three years. I came back to molecular engineering here at the Pritzker School of Molecular Engineering because I thought it offered the most diverse array of potential options. So there's everything ranging from quantum computing to immunotherapy to polymer physics. So the two tracks that we're starting with are in polymer science and engineering and computational materials with an AI and machine learning emphasis. We want to train leaders knowing that we play leadership roles in those areas. Personally, I think it's difficult not to understand what's going on in the world without having some solid understanding of polymer science. That includes energy generations to energy storage and batteries and membrane development for water purification and many biomedical applications. Really, it doesn't matter what your bachelor's is in. This is a perfect degree if you're interested in learning more about polymer science as a whole because you need a little bit of chemistry, biology, physics to really understand the field. The field of computational materials engineering is moving very rapidly. You need to uh, not only learn how to simulate these materials, you also need to uh, be exposed to modern developments in artificial intelligence, deep learning, machine learning, even concepts in robotics. I tend to be with students every day. I work with them together to do experiment and I discuss the most recent result with them. If they have questions, I can answer immediately. I see U Chicago student as dedicated and they see a problem, they don't give up. They just work hard on that. I think one of the things that we teach you is how to communicate between the disciplines. You can understand what a physicist says and explain that to the chemist. These are important attributes as we get more interdisciplinary with research in the 21st century. Now more than ever, we're sort of confronting the limits of what our conventional scientific and engineering approaches can actually provide to us. That's why we need more varied and more aggressive sorts of programs that will target things like molecular engineering. That's what makes the Pritzker School of Molecular Engineering really valuable and it's one of the things that drew me to it.